Okay, guys, I'm going to be reviewing Back to the Future Part 1. I've seen, you know, all the Back to the Future films, but I've, 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 I've seen them, you know, a long time ago. So I kind of refreshed my memory by uh, recording the first one. I wasn't able to get the other ones recorded, so I'll start by reviewing the first one that I just watched last night and finished this morning. Um, I really liked it. Um, Again, classic scenes that just become iconic, iconic lines, and you know, again, they set up, you know, like most, ba- like most, you know, movies that you know, you go to the past, you go to the future, you know, you set up certain certain details at the beginning, and obviously come back, you know, towards the film, like when, when, um, when, when you know, George gets hit by the the car, that, and then when, you know, Marty stops him, that's what obviously starts um, everything in place and all that really great stuff that, again, was told, was said what, before he went back in the future, back to the past. That's why it's like, when those, these films, you need to really pay attention because you're like, s- the slightest details, like from like the clock tower to, you know, all that stuff comes back um, in important ways throughout the film. Um, and you know, I guess you you also do, do feel the tension that that is there to to try to get from you know Marty to get his her, his parents you know back together, and I think it's, it's it's also a lot of history parts of it you know to keep an eye on. I, I wasn't alive in the eighties or the fifties, so it's like there's a lot of stuff that I don't really understand history wise, but that that's beyond that's beyond the. Point. Um, uh, you know, I think the, the way that they, you know, describe time travel, it makes sense. I think the one thing that I was kind of interested about was how do, how does, does their, does, does Marty's parents know that he went back in time? You know, or does going back in time automatically change all of that? You know, because I feel like something tells me that his parents know that Marty went back in time, but also part of me is like, maybe going back to future changes that's so a, a little bit, again, you can't have a perfect time travel explanation, Every, you know, there, there's going to be stuff that is not set in stone, but, but, but also, you know, I think, um, him being able to save, you know, Doc, or all this stuff, um, just from the beginning, and how you could see like this is the, what the eighties looks like. This is what the fifties look like. Um, uh, yeah, um, really cool. And I really like um, there's good sequences again, classics, moments, lines, and you know that I mean just make up you know the film, you know and make it as great as we always knew the film was. Uh, so there's not there's not that much I could really say beyond that. Um, really good film. Uh, really funny at times, you know, jam packed with great, you know, moments throughout. Um, that, you know, no wonder why it's still a classic to, to this day. You know, I really do think that, th- that this film is one of those films that'll be, that would be intriguing to have a. A um, prequel or not a prequel? Sorry, a a uh, reboot for because it's like can you imagine a guy from the two thousands, a kid from like a two thousands twenty, going back to the nineteen nineties or nineteen eighty five or whatever. I think that the, that that premise you know seems cool because again, this concept lends itself to be done every thirty to twenty ish years. So that you can get, like, you know, going from, like, a time where there were cell phones and there was, you know, Apple Watches and giant TV screens and Disney Plus and Netflix to a time when there was Blockbuster and, you know, D- uh, you know, all these, I mean, I don't even know, you know, what the 90s were really like because I was not around in the, 90, in the 90s. And so I think that, that also would lend itself. To a bunch of different concepts, which is why I think it's like what I love about this so much is just the concept of some you going to the past and interacting with your 
you know, parents, and, you know, your parents fall in love with you, and all that crazy stuff, you know, you like it. Stay tuned for more videos coming right at you.